Philadelphia, a South Florida grandmother is fighting for her life following a gas explosion inside her home. Her family now explaining what went wrong and how you can help. Local 10's Andrew Perez joins us live from Southwest Miami-Dade with her story. Andrew. And the family right now, their only concern, their only focus is making sure that she survives. All of their lives changing with the quick turning of a knob. The windows and shutters are blown out. Josenia Bello gets the call. Her mom is in trouble and needs help. It was terrible. You need to come here now. It sounded like a bomb went out in your mom's house. Her mom, Aleda, is rushed to the hospital with third degree burns on more than 45% of her body. The family heartbroken watching her fight in a hospital, learning a gas leak in the house led to a powerful blast on November 13th. She was putting vinegar on her wounds thinking, you know, old style Cuban that's going to help. Um, and she walked to the ambulance. So when the firefighters told me she walked to the ambulance, I felt OK, it's not that bad. This is the propane tank that feeds into the kitchen. Gas was leaking into the home and Aleda woke up to cook breakfast for her husband, who has diabetic dementia and Alzheimer's. She turned on the stove and boom, a quick flash fire erupted, but it was enough to do so much damage that has gotten worse ever since and will take some time to somewhat heal. Her legs are vacuum sealed with bags, with pressurized bags, and her arms are, are wrapped, but she has cadaver skin on top of her skin to try to keep in the, the heat. A mother of three, grandmother to seven. Her daughters say Aleda is a pillar of this family. Their focus right now is that she wakes up and pulls through. A woman known to many as someone whose faith and family means the world. She's always praying for anyone. She sees an ambulance. She passes by a funeral. She's she's always thinking about other people. So, you know, if we can get the same, if we can get some prayers, some support. It's also a really good my, uh, reminder with the holidays approaching to make sure you smell for gas to check your detectors. So many people cooking right now. In the meantime, if you'd like to help this family in any way, we're going to be putting up details on our website, local10.com. So look for that. That's the latest here in Southwest Miami-Dade, though. I'm Andrew Perez, Local 10 News.